Hey guys, it's Chantel J and welcome back to my channel where I show different hairstyles, talk about them, talk about products and things related. Today I'm going to read an article about knotless braids. We're in an era where a lot of us aren't reading as much. We are pretty much looking at pictures, hitting the like icon and scrolling. Anything longer than two sentences usually gets skipped unless the first few words are extremely catchy. Well, today I'm going to read an article while the video plays. That way you don't have to read. Just listen. It was written a few months back on the Zoe Report by Brianna Arps, and I read it today and thought I'd share. It's titled, Knotless Box Braids Are Trending. But what are they? Women of color are known to harness the spirit of originality, dreaming up creative ways that are keep their natural hair looking its absolute best. In other words, trading in everyday maintenance with simpler, easy to care for protective styles isn't just another cool trend, but rather a lifestyle they've adopted, perfected, and held extremely close. Knotless box braids are a new part of that lifestyle. Within the black community, braiding hair is very much a rite of passage. The art and skill of braiding is observed, taught, and passed on generation to generation. This sharing between generations is where we are all linked, making braids an integral part of our community and form of expression. Today, traditional individual three-strand braids have taken on many new forms, including the popular knotless style seen all over Instagram and YouTube. While it's hard to pinpoint exactly where they originated, two things are certain. They came on the scenes in urban cities. Think New York, Dallas, Atlanta, and LA roughly five years ago and originated out of a pressing interest to better protect natural hair. Now, thanks to social media, knotless box braids are everywhere. It makes sense that this technique is growing in demand during a time when women are embracing their natural hair and educating themselves more about product ingredients. They're the next natural step in ensuring that safer styling practices are available. Alongside this newfound respect for natural hair, knotless braids are painless, feather light and lay flat to the scalp, which is intentionally done to help enhance the density and length of your natural hair. Women of color are demanding healthy hair, especially from braiders. Okay, let's pause and rewind for one second. Let's go back to the sentence where it says, it makes sense that this technique is growing in demand during a time when women are embracing their natural hair and educating themselves more about product ingredients. The other day I listened to a news report and it said at least 18 products were found on the market that carried over 72% harmful chemicals. That is 72% harmful chemicals. It has endocrine disruptions in these products that we are putting in our heads and on our bodies men women and children and senior citizens because they are looking at these products online the models have fantastic healthy looking hair and they're saying that they're using this product when they're just models they're not using these products but we are buying them and we're using them on our hair and it's calling it's causing health issues now i'm going to do a video on that soon so stay tuned depending on your stylist and the specific look you're wanting to achieve install should take the same amount of time four to six hours but compared to box braids in particular you can rest assured that your delicate edges will remain intact since knotless braids are known to put way less tension on the scalp lastly if you're fighting the temptation to keep your knotless braids in longer than six weeks don't put the health of your natural hair first anything beyond this puts the hair at risk for damage especially if the client is not properly maintaining their style i use dudley's products i have used it for over 25 years dudley's use the finest raw materials they that will perform as promised they have authorized dudley sellers the company have been in business since 1967, founded by Dr. Joel L. Dudley Sr. and Dr. Eunice M. Dudley. Our current CEO is their middle daughter, Ursula Dudley Oglesby. Although you may find the products in beauty supply stores, they were not sold by the company to them. There is a strong possibility they may not be authentic. Dudley's have distributors that sell to salons who retail to consumers. 
Look for a local salon in your neighborhood for products or call the corporate office and ask them who is the distributor in your area. Buy products that you can trust. Some companies are just out to get rich quick. You are going to be shocked by some of the unknown ingredients in these other products. Edge control is recommended at the base of each one of your knotless braids. I use Dudley's Total Control Edges and Ends. It gives it that smooth hold and it's the absolute best edge control on the market. If you put edge control on your hair in the evening, tie it down, get up in the morning, it will be like magic. So you can see me rubbing it on. At the base there was a little bit left so I will be rubbing it in. You'll see me adding it to the ends of her hair to make sure it goes in the braids. That's why it's called edges and ends. It can be used for the edges of your hair and the ends of your hair. If you have curly hair, you can apply it to your curly hair. It will give it a shiny hold. There is no size recommendation for knotless braids. You can do them small, you can do them medium, or you can do them large. This client wanted her base large and the braid natural looking so that she can make a bun without having too much hair. Price wise, you can pay as little as $100 all the way up until maybe $600, depending on the size and the length. As you can see, some of the young ladies like the hair past their butts, past their hips. Some of them like it down to their knees now. With the celebrities yelling inches, inches, girls are getting their hair all kinds of lengths. And all you have to do is continue to add hair to make the braid longer and longer.